What's up guys, XRWE Kiwis here and welcome back to another video. As all, hopefully you're all doing well and staying safe. Thank you for clicking on the video. As you can tell by the total today, um, I'm, I've got 10 of the new Liga and Upgrade packs sat here. So hopefully we can get something good in them. Um, I haven't actually looked to see if anything else has come out objective wise. Um, this um, Adrissa Gay looks really good, but it's just a lot of effort. Um... What do you need for this? Squad battles, squad battles, squad battles. Alright, so you can do that in squad battles. So, even I don't even need to know his in-game stats. Um, although, 10. Oh, 10's a lot of games. So, what? 15, 19, 21. 21 games is a lot. I don't know what his in-games are like, but for a 92 rated card, I know people will say it's free, but the amount of time that 21 games would play... You're probably better off buying a 92 for SBTs if that's all he is. Um, what's his name, actually? I'll look at his in-games at some point. Fuenza. Fuenza leader. Um, yeah, hopefully uh, everybody's done well. Thank you for watching. Um, SBT-wise, there is a Nani. I don't know how much he's worth, but I looked on his card. I see 83 finishing and a clicked offer. I'm not going to lie. 83 sp uh, sprint speed as well is very low. Reactions are a little bit poor, but... It does have really good shot power, which does help if the finishing's lower. Attack position is good, passing spectacular, curve obviously brilliant. Agility's really high, balance a little bit lower, but that's not really an issue if the agility's really high. And he's 5 star, 5 star, which is obviously insane. And it's only one team as well, what is it, 86? No, any A? 85, you know what, that's not bad. Doesn't get the best of links at all. Um... Obviously, Portuguese, he gets soft links a lot, but actual strong links. Other than, like, Rui Costa, who's terrible. I mean, Eusebio, but if you've got Eusebio at this stage of the game, then you don't need to get Nani with 83 finishing. An 85 rated team for that card, though, really isn't bad. Especially for people that do like doing skills and that. Although they're hard this year, because you can't chain them, then that'll be good for a lot of people. Uh, Morva, for me, looks brilliant, but... I'm not putting that many coins into an untradeable that you don't know how good it's going to be. Um, other than that, I don't think anything else has come out. Uh, is there any leagues that have come out? Um, yeah, it's players in it that leagues are under nowadays. Um, I completed loads of these lately and just haven't restarted them yet. So, no, nothing else there. But upgrade packs, I mean, the upgrade packs are so expensive. Like, so expensive. A gold players pack there, don't really care about. Um, kits don't care about the 82 plus um it's just at uh, the 81 double plus sorry it's just 11 rares from um each thing i'm not going to do any of them yeah i will be spamming all these sort of packs on stream later today though um i've not got any today as i said but if we look at this league run one i've got 11 saved up i think um i spent about 600 700k on players before the um before six o'clock here, I've been here for since like four o'clock just buying players. And from what I've been told, the players are expensive. Like you'll see, um, I've got a load of rare players. You'll see once we go into the unassigned that I've got a load there. Let's just take like what? Let's just take two random players. We'll we'll put a goalkeeper as well to check the price. Apparently, like they're like three k. Um, so if we search him, it might be quicker. Uh, the Jiku. How much can you buy him for cheapest by now? Um, okay, so it's about people are mass listing now, so it's about twenty five hundred. Yeah, about twenty five. So once like the six o'clock and the promo packs have stopped and people are listing, it's probably going to come in at about thirty k a pack on the first day. Bearing in mind as they go along, they're always more expensive. So 30k for one pack is ridiculous. But with League Ruin, uh, you can see I've got loads of unassigned. My whole trade pile is full, as a, full of um, League Ruin rares as well. So I will be doing loads on stream later. Um, be sure to follow me on there. Uh, Twitch.tv slash X underscore sour underscore Kiwis. Because you're not allowed spaces in Twitch names. But that being said, you do get one of five. Which is a lot of picks, honestly. The fact that you only get one player back is annoying um that's probably why they haven't done like the 81 double plus for the Liga in because they know they're only given one player pack uh one player back and it would not surprise me if the pack weight for these is horrendous 
Like, you can see so far, look at that. 79 is highest rated player. There's not many league run rares either. Like, there's really not many that you can um, get that are lower rated. So, out of a few of these, I would expect to get something. Obviously, like, a Neymar, Mbappe, Ben Yedda is just out of this world. Which would be insane. But, like, surely we can pick up a couple of, like, bad team of the seasons here and there. With how much these are... Like, as I say, it's like 30k a pack, and I'm packing players that are worth 2.5k. 30k for 2 and... Are these worth it? I would say no. Like, if you've got players in the club, do one or two. If you're spending coins on these, it's really bad. I'm literally doing it because I've got loads of coins out there. And for me, I enjoy SBCs way more than I enjoy actually playing this game. The actual gameplay on this game I hate. So when I'm streaming, I would much rather sit here and do SBCs and open packs than I would actually um, play the game, which is unfortunate, but is the way for me. Like, just one of five. That's like, there we go. We get a Thiago Silva. That's decent. 95. Um, he's not great. Not going to lie. If you're looking between the two, Marquinhos is a lot better than Thiago Silva, in my opinion. But a 95 rated cannot complain whatsoever. I could give him a go. The problem is, my defence is like already on Ken perfectly, so it's so hard to switch players in and out. Obviously, I'm going to take him, but I can't imagine he's that expensive now. He's not. He's under 100k. It's going to be like, what? Probably 85k for a 95 Thiago Silva. And that's what I mean. Like Even packing a 95 Thiago Silva here out of the six packs that I've opened, I'm still down by quite a bit. So, which is why I wouldn't recommend doing loads of these. If you've got a few players in the club, then do two or three. But I wouldn't do any more than that, personally. I mean, I say that as I'm sat doing them. But I mean, for people that don't have many coins, um, yeah, I wouldn't recommend this. Uh, Rafinha. It's just, as I say, there's so many little amount of rares. There's such a high chance that you can get something. But the pack weight is just going to be horrendous. The pack weight's going to be so bad, man. Like, 70s galore. You will see the same players packed over and over again. But there is going to be some big pulls. Like, people like Castro and Bates and that are probably going to sit here and do 100 of these. And, of course, they're going to pack people here and there. But um, this has not gone well. Even with a Thiago Silva, that, that was shock, like horrendous. Even with a Thiago Silva, it's what? Um, fair, how many packs do I do? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So I've done 11, which would be about 330k. And I've made back about 150. So in 11 packs, I've already managed to lose like over 200k straight away. So, as I've said... Wouldn't recommend them if you don't have coins in that. If you're like me and you don't enjoy the game anyway, then why not if you've got the coins to do it? But if you don't have coins, I wouldn't recommend it. As always, really appreciate you guys being here and choosing to watch the video. I will be doing more of these on stream later, as I said, so be sure to come and check the channel out there. But yeah, hopefully you all done well, staying safe. If you haven't left a like on the video, then that would be really appreciated. Subscribing as well really does mean a lot to me and the channel. But yeah, that's going to be the end of the video for me guys. Thank you for watching.